In honor of St. Valentine's Day, we are making this red velvet cake, and this might quite possibly be the best red velvet cake we've ever had. It's absolutely irresistible, so here's how you make it. In a large bowl, cream together a quarter cup of softened butter, add in three quarter cups of white sugar, beat that with a hand mixer for about two minutes. Now add in one third cup of oil, one teaspoon of vanilla, one and a half teaspoons of white vinegar, and one large room temperature egg. In a separate bowl, whisk together your dry ingredients. Add half the dry ingredients into the wet, beat that together, then pour in the rest of the buttermilk. Finally, add in the rest of the dry mixture and beat that until combined. Add in one and a half teaspoons of red gel food coloring. Evenly pour the batter into two six inch cake pans. Bake at 350 degrees for 22 to 25 minutes. To make the frosting, cream together five ounces of softened cream cheese, along with one cup of powdered sugar and a teaspoon of vanilla. In a separate bowl, whip one and a half cups of heavy whipping cream until stiff peaks. Add the whipped cream into the cream cheese mixture and fold to combine. And then once the cakes have fully cooled, you can assemble your cake. And we decorated our cake by piping on some mini red hearts. 